Whether it be two-wheel drive, four-wheel drive, does not matter what you will. Today it does. We're at the Bronco Nation Corral, and I am very impressed with what they've got going on. You can see our Bronco back behind us, but there is a good block of Broncos here, and it's a testament to you guys. I was telling Dwayne with Bronco Wild or Driven Wild Outdoors now that uh, last year when I was here with uh, we were testing a Ford Bronco, I was one of three on this trip. Now look at this. This is amazing, and uh, let's go walk around and uh, maybe talk to some people, check some cool Broncos out, and we'll go from there. All right, there is the Big Ben two-door. I don't know what size engine is all in that, but it doesn't matter because it's a kick-ass Bronco. You see my Bronco. This looks like to be the uh, Cyber Orange section because there's Cyber Orange Broncos everywhere, and uh, a lot of two-doors, man. Two-door guy, I know you're out there. Keep the faith up, man. I'm seeing two-doors everywhere, so that is a good sign, and... Uh, Oh, look at that color, man. Uh, I really like that color. It sparkles in the sun. Look at this little Badlands, man. A little sport, man. They've kitted this thing up. Looks cool. I like the uh, I like the badging with that. That looks really cool. It's lit. Look at the tires on this thing. We got some uh, got some big boys on there. That looks good. It's a first edition, from what I can tell. Got the lights on there and stuff. Very nice, man. I like that a lot. Look at this. What's that tires are on these things? Let's see. It's a two fifty five sixty five seventeen, man. That's awesome. The little mud tires on that. That bad boy, of course, it's got the fenders out there. You gotta have the light bars. You gotta be light bar nation. Where you at, man? You gotta, you gotta be there. But uh, very cool, kitted out little Broncos, row after row after row of Broncos. Pretty freaking cool. All right, look at this one. Ooh, first edition, man. Look at them big wheels on that. That's pretty cool. From New York. That's awesome, man. I got the Ford Performance parts all over this thing. Looks really cool. Marching on down. Hot chili pepper red four door Badlands. Pretty cool. Look at all of these little tricked out Broncos, man. Just love this. All right, first edition Area 51. Love the carbonized gray here of the Badlands. Of course, soft top, a lot of hard tops here too. Uh, pretty freaking cool. Sid, how do you like Hi. these Broncos? They're pretty cool. Yeah, a lot of them here. Oh, there's our blue, man. Uh, rumor has it, you might see this color again, but uh, that blue, man, just, it, it looks black. I can see it in the video right now. It just looks black, but that is a just a wicked blue on that. Yeah. All right. Look at this white Bronco with those red accents. That is pretty freaking nice, man. I like it. They've debadged it. I'm always iffy on debadging, but uh, with the red accents, just simple. Looks like it's been a base. It's got the blacked out grill. Um, in the comments let me know what you think i like that it's kind of like anti-murdered out a little bit and uh just this little simple simple graphics of red there just a little splash looks great all right bronco raptor and code orange first time seeing the code orange on the bronco raptor it's great all right sid what? bronco raptor r Big. This thing's uh, 400 plus horsepower, 418 horsepower. This is a uh, this is a zoomy zoomy man. What do you think of this one? Looks cool. It's on big 37 inch tires, which was two inches bigger than our tires. Um, what do you think? You like it? Like that color? I like it. I just, I, I think ours is better. Yeah, this will be the color of our uh, our Ranger when we get one. But uh, very nice. I found a Twinsy. It's a this is a Badlands Rapid Red, which I haven't seen, but this is the only other Rapid Red I've seen, man. Uh, Kelly's not with me right now, but she would actually like this one a lot. All right, look at this, Bronco uh, Bronco 2, man. Uh, mid to late 80s, been solid axle swapped. Uh, this thing is ready for the trails. Looks like they probably got a V8 in it. <laughs> Just pretty freaking epic, man. I like these. These are starting to make a comeback. Uh, in the comments below, let me know. Do we need to talk more Bronco 2? <laughs> all right. We got the juices loose with this one. We got all the uh, the bigger Broncos out here. It's pretty cool. People displaying them. Yeah, if you want to buy one while you're here, why not? $8,000, 90,000 miles. You can buy this one. 
love this too. Look at the look at the differences in the tr in the blue, the electric blues, and the um, I forget what they call this blue at the moment. Uh, really pretty color on that, and I love the differences between the two. If you look at them, first edition, just probably a normal Badlands, yeah, normal Badlands with the Sasquatch package on this one. All right, Sid, we got a we got a two door right here. How would you, if you were gonna buy one just for you, not for the family, just for Sydney, would you pick a two door or a four door? Probably pick a two door. Really? Why is that? Cause like, if I were to have like friends in the car, I'd only bring like one or two. Right. And they can fit one or two. Yeah, oh no definitely, well, you can get four people in these. Yeah. Uh, but would you have a big lifted one? Yeah. What color would you choose? Probably that new light blue that we saw. Yeah? I'd probably pick that. The hair just, uh, I think they call that Robin's eggshell or something like that? Yeah. Really cool. All right. This is uh, antimatter blue and uh, is it is it black? Is it blue? It's almost hard to tell, man. I have polarized glasses on right now, so it doesn't help. But I, I, early on, I didn't get like the Badlands colors and some of the special trim colors. Like I like the outside badges, but some of the interior choices, but they've all run with it. And I like this, I like it a lot, how they've kind of ran with the, the color pop. A little bit of a uh, splash to the front and the grill. Tow hooks look great. And uh, in the comments, let me know. So that was the Bronco Nation Corral. Uh, once again, they did an awesome job. You know, I always give them a little ribbing every once in a while, but uh, they they did a really good job out there, and uh, they, they had a nice display. Uh, Sydney, uh, I know the two door. You kind of like that two door. We talked about if you were going to get one, the two door would be for you. Uh, I like seeing all the colors out there. Uh, clearly the eruption greens and uh, the cyber oranges were the uh, stars of the show at this one but um all kinds of it next year i have a feeling this is going to be even bigger i know all terrain nation will be back next year and uh we might have something special we're doing so you never know so sydney did you have a blast looking at all the broncos mm -hmm. well there you go simple but sweet so whether it be two-wheel drive four-wheel drive these broncos that uh, you know we're big enthusiasts and we love to drive this has been your all terrain nation in detroit and we are out. Peace, everybody. Love you all.